Hey everybody, Jason here from Mac and Tech Community bringing you another video here and this video is going to be about how you can start your own stream set up your own show and stream on Ustream.tv so I'm going to show you how you can set up your show so this is after you sign up for an account you can go to Ustream.tv sign up for a free account and then I'm going to show you how you can create your own show the easiest way. So we're going to start Firefox here. And we're going to go to Ustream.tv. And this is what, as you can see, what Ustream is. Alright, so I'm going to make this a bit bigger for you. So we are going to click log in. I'm going to log in with my account. Now once we're logged in, you're going to see this panel here. What you can do is you're going to click here. Um, my shows. Or there's an easier way. Right in the quick links. Right here. So let me make this bigger for you. Okay. So you're going to go click create a new show or create a show. Right here, it's going to say create new show. Let's name it funny show. Click create. And then it's going to bring you to that right here. So there it is, and then I can upload uh, a, um, a logo for it, and then I can also select what tags it goes under. Alright, so, and you can do channel designs, you can actually record the Ustream, and then in, in advanced settings, if you know some people that are friends or whatnot, and they have a Ustream account, you can, you can uh, input their name here as channel moderators for your chat. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to click Broadcast. And you're going to see the Broadcast window appear. There it is. This is the Ustream Broadcast window. Right there. That's how simple it is. And then I have my audio here. So, as long as you're just basically around the last three dots with your audio, um, it's going to be good. It's going to sound great. And you can, you have the audio you can adjust here by bringing it up. Bring it down. You can select what camera you want. Right now we're using a Microsoft Life VX6000 and then my audio source, which could be some of your uh, webcams might have a built-in microphone. And then I'm just using uh, my sound card mic here. You can do recording. I set my video quality up to high, my audio quality you want at high, so it sounds at 44 kilohertz. I mean it had the best possible sound. In advanced settings, you need to maybe have about 400k of upload to have a nice smooth stream. So 23 frames per second. The average will be, the default will be 11. I just bring it up to 23. This, this works great if you're on EVDO. All right, so we're going to close that. And then I click Start Broadcast. And I'm broadcasting on Ustream.tv right now. Well, let me bring my camera here. There it is. There I am. Hello. We are broadcasting. So we can bring that down. I can click Go to Show URL. And it's going to bring me to the show. And there I am. One viewer, my chat room is over on the right. That is how simple it is. So when you're in the Ustream broadcaster, what you can do if you want to get your chat room is you click show chat. It'll show up under behind here
joining room. And there we go, we can chat away. Or you can even pop it out so it pops up in its own window, which is um, going to be separate from this um, this broadcast window that you see right here. Other things you can do with Ustream is you can do overlays. You can put your um, YouTube videos in it. You can put text overlays in it. So that it will actually show on your stream. You can push it to air. You can do things like scroll it. And uh, this is a preview monitor here. So when people are actually viewing your show, they will see it. Okay, so we got that. You can even change the colors and all. You can have a link to your Twitter, so if you want to tweet or something, right then there from the broadcaster. Do a co-host if you have another friend on your, um, like if I enter mine. If you have another friend on your stream, you can co-host them. Show preview. There it is. <laughs> you can see right here. Well, that's actually a live stream that's going on right now in my main show in this corner that is going 24-7, so I just put that in co-host. So that's what you're seeing, and they're seeing what you're seeing in this video right now. So you can do all kinds of cool, neat things here. You can even do, uh, if you wanted to create a poll. Things like yes. No, up to four answers. Start your poll. It will give you results here. So if I go to my, go to show URL. Which is right here. There it is. Right there, the top left poll. Yes or no. So if I vote. It will show up here. You can stop the poll, and when you stop it, Ustream is going to actually email you those poll results to the email address that you signed up with the Ustream account with. And um, this is Ustream. This is a simple way to start your broadcast. You can even use FME by clicking up here, and it will show you instructions to get FME going so you can have an even higher quality stream with Ustream.tv. So that there is how you can stream on Ustream.tv, which I stream 24-7 on, and so do lots of other people. So if you have any questions, feel free to email us at questions at macintech.net. You can stop at our webpage at macintech.net, and our YouTube channel, which you're probably at right now at youtube.com forward slash macintech feel free to stop in to our live website where our live page is at live.macintech.net we are on macintech irc our own irc network where you can come and enjoy yourself and hang out so this has been another tutorial by jason hopefully you enjoyed the video and now you will be able to stream on ustream.tv we'll chat at you later